Hello, after some sunshine yesterday, today is a much cloudier affair and that cloud has been thick enough through this morning to bring some patchy rain and drizzle, particularly for western areas. The mist and the fog that we had along some eastern coasts has cleared away and it's actually here that we've got the best of the sunshine, but certainly the cloud cover is bringing a variety of conditions across the UK through the afternoon. Uh, quite an afternoon of contrast, grey and gloomy where we've got that thick cloud, but some blue skies and sunshine elsewhere. And actually the Northern Isles, parts of Northern Scotland, eastern parts of England, best place to see the sunshine through this afternoon. Actually, you can see some hazy sunshine just working its way a little bit further westwards. Northern Ireland should brighten up a bit through the afternoon as well. And actually feeling warmer than it did yesterday, despite more in the way of cloud. We've got a milder air mass across the UK. So top temperatures in the sunshine, perhaps 15 or 16 Celsius. But it looks like we'll see fairly cloudy skies overnight and some outbreaks of rain initially across southern Scotland, drifting its way southwards through northeast England into parts of central and eastern England. Most will stay dry. I could see some clearer skies across southeast England and here temperatures down to two or three Celsius, but for most holding up to between four and eight Celsius at least. So we start the new week with high pressure close to the UK and actually we keep it close by in the week ahead. So whereas last week was fairly wet and often windy, it's a dry week ahead with some spells of sunshine for many and a little bit warmer at first, but we'll start Monday with a lot of cloud around and still some outbreaks of rain initially through parts of central and southern England. That will ease. Most of us will see some spells of sunshine. Notice this bank of low mist and cloud pushing into parts of eastern England potentially through the afternoon. And actually eastern coast will still be on the cool side, but the best in the best of the sunshine further west we could see highs of 16, maybe even 17 Celsius. High pressure still with us as we head into Tuesday. Notice how the isobars start to come closer together. So we'll start to develop more of an east Easterly wind. Good deal of sunshine around on Tuesday for many, but we could see some cloud in the afternoon just pushing into some southern counties of England. For most, though, a dry, fine day, plenty of sunshine, but eastern coasts will start to feel that e easterly wind settling in. So just keeping temperatures pegged back to 12 or 13 Celsius, 14 or 15 further west. I think that easterly wind starts to strengthen even further as we head through the middle part of the week. And also these systems just sliding their way across, generating more in the way of cloud. Again, most will be dry, but we could see some rain developing through parts of central England and into Wales. For many though, a dry day, some spells of sunshine, but when you add on that easterly wind, some eastern coasts will feel somewhat chilly despite the sunshine. So temperatures here, perhaps just 11 or 12 Celsius. Well, we've got the sunshine though, and further west again, we'll see those temperatures getting up to around 14 or 15 Celsius. Now we need to keep an eye on timings for Thursday and Friday. At the moment, Thursday looks mainly dry with a good deal of sunshine, but I'm sure you can notice some activity happening to the southeast of the UK could start to develop some showers. Certainly for many, we're starting to feel a little bit cooler compared to the early part of the week. Then as we head into Friday, it looks more likely that we'll start to see some showers and longer spells of rain developing across the southern half of the UK. But for Northern Ireland, Northern England and Scotland, another fine and dry day with a good deal of sunshine. But we certainly need to keep an eye on the timings of that rain developing. But where well, we started the week feeling a little bit warmer, it will be feeling cooler for all of us as we head through Friday. So for the week ahead, most of us looking mainly dry, some spells of sunshine, warmer at first, but turning cooler later. Good afternoon.